Japan today in Peterborough as the Peets took on the Brandon Wheat Kings in the Memorial Cup semifinal. The Peets are really becoming the little team that could. They finished sixth in the OHL regular season, were ranked tenth nationally. But today they not only proved that they could, they went out and just did it. The host team has gone to the final the last three years, so Peets fans hoping that trend continues. Peterborough not off to a good start though. Zach Burke tries to clear the puck around the boards, picked up by Peter Schaefer. Blocks it in for a short-handed goal, and it was one to nothing. Brandon up looking good. The Wheat Kings get a chance of a power play of their own. Michael Blair stop off the ground, stuffed in the rebound. He's got it. Brandon up two to nothing. The Wheat Kings really throwing their weight around in the first. Julian drills Adrian Murray, but Brandon goalie Jamie Newman feels the pressure from Peterborough in the second as he gets turtled by his net. The Peets down two to one. Michael Williams pass goes off the defenseman to Jason McMillan, and the backhander ties it up at two. Hey, Peets are coming. On. Peter Will doesn't light it up in the third. McMillan, McMillan is stopped. Rebound sits up for Andy Johnson. Gets his first goal all year. Regular season and the playoffs. The Pete's leading at 3-2. Then the icing on the cake. Gets it ahead. Here comes That was Cameron Mann's 31st goal of the playoffs. Can you believe it? Brandon added a late goal, but the Wheat Kings fall short in this game. The host Peets, the underdogs, are headed to the Memorial Cup Final. What a game. 4-3 to three was the final. So the Peets advanced to the final for the sixth time in franchise history. That is a tournament record. Their semifinal win was also the 19th tournament win in club history. That ties a record held by the Kamloops Blazers. And afterwards, our Darren Detition talked with the man of the hour. Coming into this game, we expected uh, another uh, well-defensive round of game. Uh, Goaltenders were going to be a factor, and uh, we ended up coming out on top. We scored some big goals when we needed them, and uh, we, we came out on top. You were down two to nothing after the first period of play. Kevin Bolenbrook got you guys back in the game as he made it two to one. It went back and forth. It was tied at two. Then in the third period, you got your goal. Explain to us what you're thinking as you walk in here. Uh, I had a breakaway recently before that. I think. Uh, I just wanted to stop and bring it back, and I ended up doing that, and I uh, had an open net there. It's uh, a great feeling. So it's off to the final. Peter